All right, what's up guys? So as you can tell by the title description, today I'm gonna show you guys how to go from this to this. It's a brand new lens. Kinda messed this one up, but I'm gonna try my best to match it up. Either way, it's gonna look good, but this lens was horrible. Look, I'll show you guys a picture right now. Super bad, but this one came out clean. Uh, this one's not too bad, but it's gonna look way better with the brand new lens. So let's get to it. So for tools, you're just gonna need a 10 millimeter and a flathead. And I'll show you what to do next. All right, so flip the headlight over, remove this, this, and that, and this cover right here should just come off. All right, so to make it easier for you guys, I'm gonna just do it step by step. But in all honesty, you just gotta take off all the electrical stuff. But I'll show you how to do that uh, if you want a step by step tutorial. So this one right here and uh, this one right here, take those two off. And just like that, it comes off. Next, you're gonna wanna disconnect this clip and disconnect the clip up here. All right, so after all this is loosened up, take out the bulb in here. Loosen this up, loosen this up, and pop this lid off, and take this right here off, and you'll see what everything looks like. All right, guys. So once you pop that out, the lid, this, and that, and this one over here. What you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to disconnect this clip right here. Uh, take this bulb out and take this out. Once everything's out. Um, you're gonna wanna go right here, these four, take those out. All right, so once you get this open, this clip's gonna be connected. Disconnect this clip from right here, and uh, the HID bulb thing it should come out. Oh, Do right here. Basically, you're gonna take this whole, this whole piece is gonna come out. You just gotta figure out a way to push it. I need both my hands, but you get the idea. All right, and just like that, this is out. And next, uh, you're gonna wanna disconnect this clip right here and that clip right there. There should be two clips in there. All right, so now everything should look like this. Make sure to take out the bulb right here because you don't want the bulb to fit. So heat up and explode and you put this in your box. So this, you could take it out like but I don't want to take all these wires because it's gonna be it's gonna be hard to put all this back in because of the tight space that is right here. So my previous lights that I did, I opened everything up and just left this. I left it cracked open, so just you could just unplug it so more heat gets transferred inside, and just leave this hanging. So it won't matter if this gets heated up. Just uh, be careful not to overdo it. On my previous headlight, I did fuck it up bad. I ended up melting all this right here. And I think um, this too, there's a crack right here. And I forgot what else I messed up, but it was really bad. So yeah, so just be careful when you're heating it up. I would say 10 minutes max. That's what I did to unglue the lens from the old lens. And then on the new lens, once you put the glue on, I did it over 10 minutes. I think I did like 15 or like a little over. And that's why everything started melting. So I would just keep it at 10 to remove the lens and to put the new one back on with the glue or to heat up the glue. And also don't forget to take these things off right here. There should be another one right there. It's a hole. So more heat gets transferred through. So it's just those two. And uh, that's basically, oh no, no, no. So you're gonna have screws. These are gonna be connected to the lens. So if you just try to heat up everything without disconnecting or uh, unscrewing the screws I mean it's gonna be hard to take off so make sure to get all the screws around I think it's like four or five in total uh, let me check so it's one two three Six, so one, two, three, four, five. Oh no, there's five in total. So yeah, just get the five screws and then I'll show you what to do next. Also, make sure you use a decent sized box. So this box is good. 
Uh, yeah, it's good. So I'll show you how to cut up the holes for the heat gun, but always have the heat gun pointed this way. So where I fucked up, um, putting the other lens back on, or when I was heating up the glue, I mean right here, I didn't put it right here. So when I heated everything up to remove the old lens, I had the heat gun pointing this way. And then when I um, put the new glue on the, on the outer edge to put the new lens on, I had the heat gun pointing this way right here. So all this right here ended up melting on uh melting off like i said previously so make sure it's always pointing this way even when you put the new glue on point it down this way and uh, i'll show you i'll make the hole right now and i'll show you how to do it all right so just like that i made the hole so just make it on both sides and then uh, make sure it goes in like that make sure it's on the bottom make sure it goes through hold on let me see. So yeah, just make sure it's in like that. And uh, this is gonna be closed. And what I did, I taped it up to make sure there is no air coming out. If there's a little bit coming out though, it's fine. You can take it up, tape it up this way, like that, or this way. I just taped it up um, always to make sure no heat got outside. And just heat it up for 10 minutes. And that's it. Make sure to put a timer. I'm gonna put a timer right now. And uh, yeah, I'll show you guys how to take off the lens. All right, so put it, that's one. I put it on full blast for 10 minutes. So do that, I'll come back, I'm gonna lay down a towel and I'm gonna show you guys how to open it. And one thing I also forgot to mention, you need a flathead. I'm gonna use it to break open the bottom and I'm gonna show you guys how to open it up. And you for sure need gloves or else you're gonna burn your hands. Look, these are my, the previous gloves I used, they still have the sticky glue stuff on and my hands were burning, like the, they should get hot, so you gotta be careful. So if you can, buy some better gloves. These did the job, but I burned myself, so be careful. So what you're gonna wanna do, you're gonna wanna, since it's an old lens, it don't matter if you get like glue stuff on it, but like start cracking it open the bottom you see how it's popping out but, but be careful and try not to get goo on the projector this is harder than it looks like you have to keep at it keep going Sure to not get glue. Oh, did I break something? I think I did break something. <sighs> yeah, I broke something. screws one two three four five six seven eight nine let's take all those off oh the whole thing pops off and uh so since you took all of them off the top piece right here pops off as well so you could either clean it or not, it's up to you. I'm gonna clean it. And basically that's it, we just put this onto the new lens. And just for demonstration, that's the old lens. That's the new one, big difference. All right, so what you guys can do next, get some alcohol, just get a towel. Just wipe every down, everything down and clean it. And then once everything's nice and clean, you could install it onto your new lens. All right, so I got everything installed. Here's the new lens. It's gonna be kind of hard. So the way you have to install it, you have to start um, from the top, like at an angle. The top has to go under, then you push it down. 
And then right here, you just put all the screws in. And right here, you're gonna have to push for the little LED bar to go down, because if not, this is not gonna wanna go down. So you have to just push that down so it puts down. And that's basically it. All right, so after you do all that, um, you see all that gray stuff right there? It's all glue right there. You can see that I, that's why I broke it. I'm gonna try to glue it right there. It's bulky or bolt. I can't say it, but it's like B U T Y L or B U Y T. I don't know. But anyways, so I'm gonna put it back in here. Ten minutes. After ten minutes, I'm gonna grab this, the cover, push it on, and I have this little clamp thing to help me like hold it down. I'm probably gonna look for another one. Um, and yeah. And as you guys can see, we're back. Look at how good these lights came out. Look, brand new. Brand new. I'm excited with the results. If you guys want to do the same thing, go for it. Just uh, be careful. I learned from my mistakes. Uh, I kind of want to buy another pair that's messed up and try to resell it and make some money. But yeah, that's what it looks like, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Alright guys, it's night time. Just want to show you guys what they look like. They look pretty good. Yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, let me know if you guys have any questions. Peace out.